Hey guys, Machine Gun Kelly just released another cover of a song that I absolutely love. It's called Champagne Supernova by the band Oasis, and I absolutely love the original. Like, it's an amazing song. If you haven't heard it, you should go listen to it. It's just absolutely incredible. And I love how he's been doing all of these covers of, like, old school music. That's one thing that I love specifically about Machine Gun Kelly. He's not just a rapper. He's got a lot of these old rock, punk rock styles and influences in his music. And I absolutely love that. I think that really sets him apart from the rest of the rap game, if you want to call it that. And I know he's got a lot of songs with Young Blood as well. One of his like number one songs is I Think I'm Okay um, with Young Blood. And that's an amazing song as well. But I have yet to hear this cover. Very interested to check it out. Uh, yeah, let's get into it. How many special people change? How many lives are living strange? While we in, while we were getting high. Mm. Slowly walking down the hall, faster than a cannonball. Where were you while we were getting high? Oh. He can hit the notes. I'm telling you, he can hit the notes. I find it very interesting that they're like recording it in like a bathroom or something. I'm guessing maybe, I mean, I know we're all in like quarantine or whatever. MGK just released his uh, Smoke and Drive cover in his car and now they're in a bathroom. So maybe there's like a theme going on with all the quarantine stuff. Um, very interesting. It adds like some reverb to their voice though, which I like. And Youngblood, I will say, he does kind of creep me out with his appearance. But the guy has some freaking pipes on him. He can freaking sing. If you've heard any of the other music that he's been in, he can sing. Like he, he's great. Where were you while we were getting high? Someday you will find me. freaking love i love machine gun kelly's getting into a lot of this like singing stuff which i freaking love i mean everybody knows he's a great rapper he's a really really fantastic rapper but he can sing he really can and i just i love the tone of his voice i really do and i think you know he can really excel in this genre of music he's starting to branch out and get into a lot more of this type of stuff and i love it absolutely love it <laughs> Wake up the dawn and ask why Dream and dream she'll never die Why that tear away now from your eye Slowly walking down the hall Faster than a cannonball Where were you while we were getting high? Uh. I will say, I will say, I hope this is not an unpopular opinion. I like Machine Gun Kelly's voice here more than Young Blood, And I think it's because the bathroom is doing him a little bit of injustice here. Young Blood has a really amazing high range. His vocals can really peak up there, but I think that wherever they're filming this at, it looks like a bathroom. I think the reverb and just the... Uh, the acoustics in there are not really, uh, I think they're like kind of overdoing it a little bit. But Machine Gun Kelly's voice just really like resonates in there because he's got the deeper tone 
and I think for me that's why I just I like his voice more than most people in general. But specifically in this scenario, I like it a little bit more than Young Bloods. Doesn't mean I don't like Young Bloods. Just throwing that out there. He's still amazing. Makes it look so easy too. Oh, and that's it. That's the end right there. I feel like that was a shortened version. That was a shortened version, right? Oh, I wanted that to go on for another minute or two. Ah, oh, jeez. All right, that was a Champagne Supernova cover by Machine Gun Kelly and Youngblood, and I gotta say. I liked it. I really did. Another great cover. I, you, it's really hard to beat the original sometimes. I absolutely love the original, but I do think it was a really great cover. I did like Machine Gun Kelly's voice more in this scenario than Youngblood simply because of, I think, where they were recording it at. And again, that is not shots at Youngblood. I think he has freaking pipes. The dude can sing. He really can. But just with the tone of MGK's voice, it really just kind of resonated in that environment. I just loved it. Um, great freaking song. I love that they keep cranking out these covers. I'm going to be checking them out. If, they, if there's more covers coming out, I'm going to be checking them out for sure. Um, but aside from that, if there's other MGK songs that anybody here is interested in me checking out, please feel free to throw them out there. Again, I know my channel has been primarily metal, metalcore, electronicore. Um, genres in that realm but I am also interested in other genres and I do specifically love MGK listen to a lot of his older music back in the day um, not so much as newer stuff so if I should check that out please let me know um, but yeah other than that if you're still here if you're still watching thank you so much and of course as always I'll see you on the next one